there, over there. But I made a bit of a, like a bit of a meal of that situation. I'm gonna have a look at that in analysis on this one. That was not good. Captures, captures, yeah, so really all they need to do is take it, then one because then the bishop can come here. So we go there. He doesn't have to take, he can leave it there while the bishop does this. And we take, pawn takes, we attack the pawn. We could always just bring that there. Yes, yeah, so it's still showing them as winning type thing, but they'd have to work for it. Hmm, okay. Yeah, we made a blunderous situation with ourselves, I think. We messed up out. Chasing the knight, and I thought we were doing okay chasing the knight. This is the type of thing that I pick up from evaluation, but the computer does it at a certain point, a certain time, and I obviously have chosen the wrong one. First one seems to be okay, but then chasing it again, maybe I should have just left it alone. Attacking with the bishop, making... Look how simple that is now, and then just castle. Oh, lesson learned. Yeah, the pawn chasing for the knight, it all depends on the circumstance. Got to look at it a lot. Um, objectively because that didn't improve my position on the board it just was chasing a piece around that was eventually going to improve its own position which it did do and we ended up basically being potentially a minor piece down if the opponent had played it correctly so got to keep it simple 